welcome or welcome back to my channel my name is Naraya Amari and today is Sunday so happy Sunday I haven't started a weekly vlog on a Sunday yet so this is new for me um, I definitely have a lot of things going on this week last week was super busy I still have to edit the vlog for last week so I'm definitely behind because I shouldn't be editing I should be uploading but today um, is really given go sit out in the sun or go to the pool with a fruit bowl or something like that and just rest. But I actually have so much to do. So I am like in between thinking about what it is that I should do. Should I just take this rest day and like recover because I do have a busy week ahead of me or should I get things done? And when I say get things done, I don't have to get a ton of things done. I just really need to do my laundry. I've already cleaned my apartment. I need to do my laundry and edit last week's vlog and get that up. So that's really like the main thing that needs to be done. So I think I'm probably going to try to combine both. Like I'm probably going to go out and get myself like an acai bowl or smoothie bowl or something like that. Or even make one at home and then see if I can find a place where I can edit outside. literally been inside editing all day it is 8 32 p.m so that's part of what i wanted to get completed today i did really want to go outside and like spend some time in nature but it was hot today so i just stayed inside all day where it's on this vlog this is taking me pretty long and this vlog is also pretty long but i'm almost done now um what I have to do I have to choose like one more song to add on to the vlog and that's it but before I go to bed I do want to do a face mask and I want to take on my planner and make sure that I have everything straight um for this week just because I'm gonna have a busy week again kind of but I want to make sure that I'm not overworking myself and I'm not overtired and I'm taking time to like balance work as well as like self-care and house things stuff like that so yeah, I'm going to take out my planner and write everything down. I don't know if it's just me or if I'm like actually extra pretty today. Because I do feel really pretty today. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and do this face mask. Face mask? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and do this face mask. This is the Lori Harvey yogurt face mask. This is like my third time trying this. Hopefully my lashes are completely off by the end of this vlog. Um, but I don't have like one of those silicone mask applicators. So I'm literally just using a spoon and my fingers. I just wash my face and I wash my hands. It's cold. I really like this mask so far though. It makes my skin super soft. And I don't care to put it like super neat or anything like that. I just try to get even layers so that it can all dry together. I have a new skincare routine now too. It's just slightly different. Like I just bought a couple new products. So I think I'm going to do like a new skincare video um, this week to show my new skincare routine <laughs> Ready to make an entrance, so back on up Before I have to pull the 
strap out the cut. Give me the microphone first so I can burst like a bubble. Captain and Lone Beach together, now you know you in trouble. Cause ain't nothing but a G thing, baby. Too low down G, so we crazy. Death Row is the label that pays, man. Unfatable, so please don't try to fade this. But uh, back to the lecture at hand. Perfection is perfected, so I'm a lad, I'm understanding. From a young G's perspective. And before me, they got a trick, I have to find a contraceptive. You never know, she could be earning her man and learning her man. Then at the same time, burning her man. Now what she burning her Happy Monday. Today is Mondaying for sure. And like, what I mean by that is, it is only 11.05. Is it gonna show? No, it's not gonna show. Okay, it's only 11.05, but I've done so much already. Like, the first thing I did today was get up and go to the gym. I haven't been to the gym in three weeks. And I had like a, like a trainer, and then I had my co-workers like they joined us at the gym so we had like this little group going on and then i took three weeks off so <laughs> they were definitely hard on me today because it's like me and then three guys and they're not like regular scrawny guys no they're like big strong guys who have me doing like all these crazy upper body workouts and stuff like that but they definitely pushed me they cut me off like they didn't want to be my friend because i missed my workout and I was just like, I don't think that's right. Um, and I definitely went to the gym today at a certain time with the intentions of seeing them and, you know, getting back in the group. But I didn't think it was going to be that quick. Like, I thought it was going to take a couple of days. Like, I thought I was going to see them today and, like, just say hi, but they wasn't really going to pay me any mind. But no, it only took 10 minutes. So now I'm back with the gang, I'm back with the family, and I feel good. Um, but they definitely pushed me today. So I had to make sure I got like a little protein shake in my water because if I don't drink this water, I'm not going to be able to walk tomorrow. Like I'm going to be completely cooked. So I got up, got dressed. Got on Zoom for work, checked a couple emails, finished editing a video. I was supposed to finish editing that video last night. I thought I was going to be able to wake up and like post the video this morning. I thought it was going to be fine, but no, it wasn't. I don't know. At first, like it wouldn't save to my computer and kept saying it didn't have enough space. So hopefully we get that up and running. For the rest of the day today, I have to drop off my laundry at my mom's. She's going to be so kind as to help me out with my laundry. Don't ask me why I have so much laundry because I don't know. It's literally my least favorite drawer and just thinking about it makes me anxious and upset. So dropping it off. I have to get an oil change. I have to go to the bank and get a check. I have to drop off some paperwork. I have to go get something for one of my kids at work. And then I have to go to my second job. So that's why I say today is Mondaying, like for sure. I feel like, um, I don't know. I just have like the most energy to get tasks done on a Monday. Like by the time Wednesday comes, I'm done. So I'm over it. I have to like try to squeeze this all into today. So it's 11.08. I don't have to be to my other job until three so um, i got a lot to do basically because ain't no loving good enough to get burned while i'm offended yeah and that's real of the real deal holy feel and now you hook us and hoes know how i feel well if it's good enough to get more off a proper chunk i take a small piece of some of that funky stuff it's like this and like that and like this and uh it's like that and like this and like that and uh it's like this and like that and like this and uh drink creep to the mic so i'm literally just now leaving the place where i went and got my oil changed and that shit blew me so bad like i probably should have did that last but i didn't know how long it was gonna take and i didn't want to like be late or just be driving around in my car with it not right but basically i am driving around in my car with it not right and you know every time you go to the mechanic they start telling you you got a thousand dollars worth of things wrong like first off 
my dad is gonna cuss me out when he sees this but there's no way I just paid $130 for an oil change and it's because of um like the make of my car <sighs> it's because the make of my car but one like I feel like this car is mad expensive to maintain I can never get any service performed for a normal price or like at a normal place I always gotta jump through hoops to find a mechanic who can service my car and then like i just want a new car like i just feel like this car is just so expensive it's so complicated and this one is like falling apart because i haven't been taking care of it which is my fault but i just want like a regular car that needs regular maintenance or something like that i don't even need to drive a car because i clearly i don't know what i'm doing but that just blew mine like my whole mood i have a whole attitude right now so I'm gonna try to push through and complete the rest of these errands for the day um, as much as I can before I have to go to work. It's one o'clock now, so I have like two hours, like like one hour really, because I gotta go back home. But I have like a little bit of time, so we'll see. tired i just got home from work i showered um did my skincare routine and now i'm ready to go to bed but the only reason that i'm getting on camera is because i want to say i'm really proud of myself because i completed every single errand that i had to run today and that is not me like any other time i quit at like the smallest inconvenience like if something gets in my way or like how I had an attitude over the oil change or whatever, I would really come home and just have an attitude for the rest of the day and be like, you know, whatever else I have to do can wait till tomorrow. And then tomorrow turns into the next day, to the next day, to the next day. But today, I literally completed every single task and that's going to make the rest of this week so much easier. So even though like I was pretty hard on myself today in terms of just waking up and getting so much done like i'm exhausted as fuck but i feel like it's gonna pay off because i'll be able to rest more and like just take more leisure time throughout the week um hopefully that's how this goes sometimes i question like all right should i push myself and keep going just to get things done or should i like listen to my body and my brain and just take the rest but i don't really know i don't really know which one is right so I don't know but yeah I am proud of myself for getting everything done today not sure if I'm ever gonna do that again but you know 